forever since I have made a more with Moro's video. I know I just did a what I eat in a day video, but I just feel like it's different than like my usual cleaning, organizing videos or project videos, which we're actually currently in the middle of filming one right now because I know you guys miss our projects and Frank is able to do the specific projects, so stay tuned for that. But today I want to do a get it all done because I feel like I have a million and one things I need to get done and I have been like procrastinating all day now and I just now am more overwhelmed and stressed. Let me know if that happens to you guys. Do you guys get more overwhelmed and stressed and you don't know where to start but then you stress about that and then you don't do anything for like the longest time and then you realize what time it is and now you're even more stressed. That's me right now. So this actually might be over two days, today and tomorrow, depending on how much I get done today. But I am starting the girls' laundry and confession. I actually have some of the girls' clothes already folded in their room. I think Fletcher and Nola's clothes are with their clothes too, but I have not put those away yet. And here I am starting more laundry. So I'm just gonna end up putting it all away together once I get this laundry done. But actually, I got them some new clothes, so I need to probably go ahead and put that in here as well. Just adding some OxyClean and some fabric softener and obviously laundry detergent. Let me go ahead and start taking the tags off of all the clothes that I got. And we're gonna go ahead and get started for the day. I get so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am falling I'm so deep down, deep down And it's not a lie That I die I can't hide the clothes that I was talking about that I have not put away yet. I think it's been in this basket for about four or five days now. So I'm gonna go ahead and take everything out, put the clothes, like the clean clothes on the girl's bed. And like I said, there's Fletcher and Nolan's clothes in there. So I'm actually, I'm thinking about just going ahead and putting it up now. I know I said before that I was just gonna wait until I got done with the rest of their laundry, but I think I'm just gonna go ahead and do it now. And I'll put up the rest later. It's in my birthday yet, yeah, cause I gotta say You're looking like a gift for me Wrapped up nice and neat, baby Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part where it all begins You could be the first and the second and the third And the rest of it Bye. 
fast, baby, I will show you how you can catch my vibe And right away I so much time looping in the blurry lights Get in my way now, don't be shy, we'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got the system, my favorite things, you could be the puppet I think I was like so overwhelmed with everything that I had to do that I just kept procrastinating and procrastinating and then I didn't even get hardly anything done on my to-do list. So today we're going to finish that and right now I am doing the boys laundry. I already put up the girls laundry and folded their second round of laundry so um, I just have to hang it up again. They have more clothes, and I always say this, but I feel like I'm doing laundry every day because I am doing laundry every single day. I feel like as soon as I get done with the kids' clothes and get them all folded and put away, I'm already having to start another load of laundry. So I'm going to finish the boys' clothes. I'm going to go ahead and put all of their clothes up, and then I really need to mop our floors. Our floors are so disgusting, especially since it's been really warm outside. So the kids have been in and out. Well, the kids and the dogs have been in and out. So our floors are just like completely <laughs> trashed right now and they just need a good cleaning. So I'm going to definitely accomplish that today. And I'm trying to think what else now that I'm like ready to tackle my to-do list. I'm like, what else do I need to do besides laundry and cleaning the floors? Oh, I need to organize all of the dogs. Stuff, so I'm gonna do that a little bit later today and then I'm so ADD like I'm self diagnosing myself because I have literally all the characteristics and traits I can't ever focus on one thing and then usually I just end up doing a million other things so it's probably what you're gonna see for the rest of this video so let me finish there this. is only one of you only one of me there's a million of those who won't let us be but they're not gonna, not gonna see me bleed Cause baby, I got you, 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 you I've been beaten to the ground, dragged across the dirt I've been scared to live cause some people never learn But they're not gonna, not gonna watch me burn Cause baby, I got you, 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 you done putting a whole bunch of Aria's clothes in here that I've been saving for Harlow that doesn't quite fit her yet. It was taking up so much space in the girls room so I put all of it in this big container actually down here. I have clothes that I need to give away that are Fletcher's clothes like um, 18 to like 12 or 12 to 24 month clothes that I need to give away. I actually have a whole box of stuff on the porch right now that somebody in the neighborhood is going to pick up from all his newborn clothes, which I'm trying not to think about because it's making me really sad, but I'm so out of breath right now, so excuse that, but I just got done putting all the girls' clothes away, like all of their clothes. They have way too many clothes, and at some point I need to, I mean, it looks pretty organized, but it's kind of cluttered, so I need to figure out what I'm doing with all of that stuff up there, but everything's put away i got everything color coordinated i know i'm super crazy about that it does take a little extra time but i love it because if i'm picking out an outfit i'm like oh yeah that green shirt is right here oh yeah that pink dress it's right here so it's nice to have everything kind of color coordinated i have even their pajamas <laughs> color coordinated here's harlow's side i have all of their pajama tops and then it goes to dresses and jumpers and then they have their tank tops short sleeves 
long sleeves. Scarlet side is basically the same way. Tank tops, short sleeves, long sleeves, pajama tops, and then all of her dresses over there. And then they have all their princess dresses in here. I actually just got this organizer off of Amazon. We have one downstairs in our coat closet. I personally love it because I can fit so many of their shoes in there. Aria has one in her room. It's like 10 bucks on Amazon. So I'll link that down below in the description. You just hang it on the door and you can close the door easily. Won't mess it up. Now moving on to Nolan's room. I got all of his pajama bottoms folded, organized. And then he has all of his shorts in here. We actually just got a whole bunch of new shorts from Old Navy because they were having a really good sale right now. And then his pants are in here. So I got all of that folded and put away. And then all of his shirts are also color coordinated from short sleeves all the way to long sleeves to pajama shirts. The other morning, he's like, mommy, I can't find my baby Yoda shirt. I said, okay, well, what color is it? He said, oh, it's white. <laughs> so then he just went over here. I was like, see, it helps to be color coordinated. So now moving on to Petchy's room. Oh my gosh, he <laughs> jetted out of here. What are you doing? So I got all of his clothes put away. We have his pajama bottoms over here. Pants. Oh, no, nope, don't take him out. He loves to take I'm not here. You want to wear that tonight? We'll wear them tonight. So we got his long, or what am I saying? Long sleeves. Long pants. Uh -uh -uh. Nope, nope, nope. We're going to close it. I have to be careful with him because he loves to pull this out sometimes. And then all of his shorts down here. Random hats that I... I didn't know what to do with. Okay, let's close it. Let's close it. Watch your shorts. Yes, watch your fingers. And then all of his clothes, of course. His are also color coordinated. Most of you guys already know that I color coordinate all the kids' clothes. Even Aria starts color coordinating her clothes now. But I have all his short sleeves up here, pajama bottoms up here, long sleeves over here, long pajamas over here. Like jumpsuits, things like that, that are a little bit longer. Nope, we're not gonna get that out right now, okay? Not right now. I also went ahead and restocked all of his diapers in here and also his wipes. So I think I'm pretty much done with cleaning up here. I might actually come in here and vacuum the kids' rooms because now that I'm looking at Fletcher's rug, I'm like, I need to vacuum it. And I know Aria's room needs to be vacuumed too. But I'm gonna move downstairs and get a few things done down there first, and then I'll come back up here and vacuum. What? What are you doing? You dancing? Oh, you're a good dancer, buddy. You know the drama is never ending. Don't let it get the best of you. And all the fake friends just keep pretending. That's how the little things get. talked about this yet on my channel but we got rid of our well we didn't get rid of it we still have it but I stopped using it pretty much except for like quick cleans I'll use it but I switched to a mop the brand is O Cedar and you guys I did not think I would use a mop I was against it for the longest time Frank eventually got it and I absolutely love it I would recommend getting this one because you can spin it over here with just your foot fill it up well fill it up right here the water fills up right here and i even have the solution it's zep hardwood and laminate floor cleaner and i really like this cleaner it's out of all the cleaners that i've used for the floor this one is definitely my favorite but i noticed when i took all the dog stuff out to go through it and organize it that it was so 
disgusting in here. Look, I, I couldn't, I don't even know what that is. I couldn't vacuum that up, but there was just like so many different things, food, random stuff, sticky stuff, I don't even know. So I just took everything out and I just got done vacuuming it and now I am going to mop everything. And what I also really love about that mop is I can get the baseboards too, because they're really, really dusty. So I'm also gonna make sure that I give the baseboards a good cleaning too. going non-stop today so I got the upstairs vacuumed and mopped and then I needed to spot treat our couch even though I just cleaned it last week and it was the cleanest it's probably been in a very long time and then Fletcher loves to go outside and play in the dirt and then when he comes inside he like smears his hands everywhere all over the couch and everything so, so you can tell by all these spots there was like some dirt, some stuff that they spilled, some of it I don't even know. And just that little, those little sections, you guys, look. This is how dirty it was. <laughs> I 
I was dying when you guys were commenting forbidden chocolate milk on my Instagram because that's exactly what it looks like. It looks like nasty chocolate milk, except for this one looks super dark and nasty. Oh.